grab your favorite hop, go head up to the track. Take your place for some speedway fun when Pud Pud enters the race. Pud Pud enters the race. Okay, Pep, okay. Ready, Pep? Catch! Special delivery, Pud Pud. Wowie, zowie! Oh boy, it's from Redline Rick. It says I'm invited to join the Car Town 500. Hot ziggity! Well, I hate to run, uh, but I got more mail to um deliver. I'll be talking to you later, Pot Pot. Hey, Pep, come on, pal. Hey, how are ya? Noxus Flack here, and here's another Putt Putt game by Humongous Games. I've always been a huge Putt Putt fan when I was a kid, but I only had one game, and that was Putt Putt Travels Through Time. Today we will be playing Putt Putt Enters the Race, which, uh, frankly, I don't know why more Putt Putt games don't involve races. It is a car game. <laughs> But before we get started, I had a few things out of the way. I have never played this game before. I got it on a summer steam sale, and all I did was make sure my recording software could hear both my voice and see and hear the game. After that, I have not gotten past this screen, so I'm going to be doing it all live for you, the viewer, with my very limited knowledge of this game. But, let's begin. Didn't expect that. Hey, folks, don't forget to recycle those bottles. Do your part. That's my gas gauge. That's my gas gauge. All right, and we're off. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe for more Putt-Putt Adventures. What's going on here? All right. Classic Humongous Games. Click on everything for fun. Okay, Pep, give it a try. Yeah, so that was a little hint there. We'll get that armadillo out of there. Good boy, Pep. Gosh, I sure hope we didn't scare that little guy too much. We well, scared him off the road. I guess I can keep on driving. We, he's, he's terrified. All right, that's not an item to pick up. Understood. That's a monkey. Car cartoon Speedway. Speed oh, I just said cartoon. Ooh, I didn't have a choice in the matter there. Hi, Redline Rick. Well, if it isn't my little buddy Putt Putt, are you here to sign on up for the Big Car Town 500 race? You bet, Redline Rick. Pep and I have been waiting all year. Well, Whoa. Putt Putt, if you want to be a race car, you have to be able to grip the road, race like the Dickens, and always keep safety first. Yep. So you might have to get some things. I know. I can get whatever I need in Car Town. Well. Here's a list of all the things you'll need to get. You'll need high-powered, high-octane gasoline, of super course. speed rated racing tires, Obvious. a safety helmet for Boo, Beth, lame. and a triangular flag with the number four on it. Yeah, that adds That's horsepower. That's your official number. Thanks, Redline Rick. I can't wait. I better get busy. I have a lot of gear to get before the big race. Also like to point out that this uh, humongous game just needs to give everyone an accent. Now Redline Rick is, you know, quickly becoming one of my favorite characters since the wizard in Travels Through Time. I tell all my champions, if you want to feel the speed, set a record, go the distance, you've got to have safety first. Otherwise, it might just be your last lap. Safety well, first that's uh, pretty dark for a kid's game. Oh. What's happening there? Go putt putt, go putt putt, racing up and down the speedway. Well, putt putt's gonna race, and what? that's a sure bet. He's a groovy little car with a dog named Pep. When he revs up his engine round the speedway, Is this the Beach Boys know. right now? All the other cars shout, go putt putt, go. Go putt putt, go putt putt, racing up and down the speedway. When I give the green flag, it's a signal to go. With Pep's new helmet, he'll be safe, you know. To get the power you need, I can feel he's a must. Racing with the cars, kicking up all that dust. Go, Papa, go, Papa, racing up and down the speedway. See Pep's flag a flapping with his number on the side. He's the coolest little car on a crazy wild 
ride. The Car Top 500 is the best race to run. And Puck could win it, so let's go have some fun. Let's go! Speedway to the finish line He's zooming with the cars Having a grand old time He's got the extra speed To take the curve so fast The Cartel 500 short is a blast Go Papa, go Papa Racing up and down the speedway Go Papa, go Papa Racing up and down the speedway I have never seen something like that. <laughs> no, I haven't. pop up travels through time. If you click on the characters in the time portal area, you'll get a song like that. But that was legitimately like a Beach Boys song. That was awesome. In comparison, you are quite disappointing. I'm telling you, there's nothing like cruising the black top here at the Speedway. Makes my heart and motor race. I can't wait to try it. All right, that was, uh, wow, that was a lot. To car town we go. This looks familiar. Well, we gotta get to the gas station to get some high-octane gasoline. It's car town gas. Extra high-powered, high-octane gasoline. Fill her up. Whoa, I'm humming like a race car. Oh, our speedometer changed. Is this forever now? Oh, whoa, whoa. It's the car town wash. That extra high powered, high octane gasoline doesn't last very long. I should take some of it with me to the race so I can use it there. Bottle. An empty bottle? This doesn't belong here. I should recycle it. Does the voice actor sound a little different? Free batteries. I don't know what it they're for. It says free. Those you batteries must be free. You don't need to be sketch Wait, about it. It says these free. These might come in handy. Hey, you, you don't need to like act like you're doing something illegal. Come on. Neato. This looks like great fun. What is this? I'm confused. Oh, it's a pachinko machine! I thought it was pinball at first, but what's going on with those cars on the right? Full speed! Oh, okay, alright, okay, that's doing something. Oh, I can ruin it! I recognize viewers, this is not what you came for, but here I am, playing Pachinko, in a putt putt tra travels in time. Putt putt joins the race game. Oh, we gotta get in that one. Yes. Now full speed. No! I think my goal at this point is for those two cars to finish racing. Oh, I'm gonna get some mean comments for my Pachinko game. Oh, what are you gonna do about it, boys? Who had their money on yellow? Because yellow just won it. I wanna leave. No, 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 let me leave. Oh, are you ready is. to go? Yeah, oh, I felt trapped by it. You ever felt trapped by a pachinko machine? Oh my gosh. If it isn't my favorite customer, Butt Butt. Hi, Mrs. Widget. I wanted to thank you for the free batteries. Oh, you're welcome. That's what they're there for. I'm trying out all the new toys in the stock room. Oh, want to make sure they work just right. Have fun. Oh, I always do. So that was Bumper Car. All right, what's over here? Car Town Color. Whoa, it would be great to get a new paint job. I don't know, purple's pretty good on you, Putt Putt. I don't know if you need that. Let's see what's over here. The Fire Welcome Station. Welcome to Putt Putt. 
What can I do for you today? I just stopped by to say hi, Smokey. It's always nice to have you visit. Thanks, Chief. That's just, we're just here to chat, I guess. All right. Peace out, Girl Scout. Oh, you know what I just saw? Similar to the sock collection. Hey, the an Sam. empty bottle. I've been meaning to get that recycled. Say, Putt Putt, if you wouldn't mind, could you take it to be recycled for me? Yes, sir, Smokey. I'd be happy to. I wonder if we fill all of these with high octane gas. Thanks, little fella. That's or, a big help. Or we uh, trade it in for something. Let's go to the grocery store. What's up? Good morning, a putt putt. Good He's still morning, Italian. Mr. Baldini. I'm getting ready to race in the Car Town 500. Oh, that is so exciting. You let me know if there's anything I can do to help you. Thanks, Mr. Baldini. I will. Hey, a putt putt. I'm getting a little low on produce. How'd you like to do me a favor and go out on the farm and pick me up some more, huh? Sure. What do you need, Mr. Baldini? Well, uh, let me see. I need a one of orange, one of zucchini, and a one ahead of lettuce. <laughs> nice outline. Okay, I can get that. Excellent. Excellent. You bring them back to me in this box, and I'll give you two of coins, Putt Putt. Gee, thanks. I could use some coins, Mr. Baldini. So Great. Uh, well, a good luck. I'm pretty sure the coins are just, uh, oh, unexpected. Pretty sure the coins are uh, only good for the, uh, well, two coins will just get me a car wash. Three will get me a car color. Oh, no, hey, we got a sad it's story. Chuck, and it looks like he's in trouble. Oh, they let me do that. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> All right, sorry, I was just messing with you, Chuck. What's Pot, up? Pot. How's my little buddy? I'm fine, Chuck, but what happened to you? Oh, one of my rubber radials hit a nail, popped it like a balloon. <laughs> I'm one stuck Chuck. Maybe I can help. If you would, I'd be a happy tow truck. How's about heading over to my tire setter and picking me up a tire patch kit? And judging by my tire, you'll need to cut it into a square. Oh, I can I do hate that, that, Chuck. Thanks, I hate that all. I'd be much obliged. There's no world where that is an acceptable situation. All right, let's go down here. What's this? Oh! Hi, Outback Al. It's Outback well, Al. Well, Putt Putt. Long time no see, That's baby. Like last How week. do you like my newest addition? It's a baby bush baby. Oh, it's so cute. This little fella arrived late last night, all the way from Africa. Well, he's very cute. All right, I don't want to hear that again. Oh! Outback Al, are you saving that empty bottle for recycling? Not saving it exactly, matey. It's been sitting gathering dust. You're welcome to take it. Please. Gee, thanks. Man, I'm really just cleaning up this town. All right, someone's spooking in the backyard over there. Hello, Mr. Fenderbender. Well, if it isn't Pit Pit, why you'll never guess. I you mean, call me? never guess what happened. Bonzo, my cat, ran straight down this hole, and now he won't come out from under the house. Gosh, I don't think I can reach in there. But maybe I can find something that will make him want to come out, Mr. Fenderbender. Well, if you did, that would be the cat's bow wow. I mean, the cat's meow. All right, he's the worst character. Why, 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 why is the cat down there? Odd hey, animals. odd animals of the alphabet. I'd like to take a look at that. A is for aardvark. B. Bush baby. C. Am I really doing D. this right now? E. Remember when Australia had a war against those? F. G. H. I, J, K, L, M, Mud Skipper, N, O, P, Q. I'm doing the whole alphabet right now. R. Yep. S. Yep. Pretty excited for what X is gonna be. T, U. That's a person. U is for Walkeree. In the Amazon lives this monkey, and Walkeree is his name. 
He's got a bright red face, you see, and it's his claim to fame. I'm not clicking on w. all of them. W is for Wombat. The Wombat has great spiky hair, and he's roly-poly as a bear. If he's chased, he runs to hide, finds a hole, and sticks his head inside. Luke Skywalker likes shooting X. this. X is for Zyphosura. Zyphosura is quite a proper name, but he's a horseshoe crab all the same. He has lived in mudflats along the coast for 300 million years, and that's no boast. Okay. Y, y is for Yak. In yak. Asia lives the great wild yak, who has a hairy head and a hairy back. The parents graze on grass and leaves, and babies drink the milk they need. All right, Z for zebra. Z. Okay, you tricked me. I'm out. Those are the library safety scissors. I can use them to cut out shapes, but I don't have anything I want to cut now. Okay, thanks for that. Super I shouldn't bottle. bother him. He's reading. That's a good lesson for children. Alright, so if I need to get something cut, I can go to the library. Music change. Putt Putt, hello! Hi, Mrs. Airbag. How are you doing today? <laughs> Mrs. Just Airbag. fine, Putt Putt. Okay. Mrs. Airbag, I was wondering if you wanted me to take your bottle to the recycling center today. So that we are be taking a big it to help, the recycling Putt -Putt. center. Thank you. Okay, and I'll bring the coin back for you. Oh no, Putt Putt. You can keep the coin. Gee, thanks, Mrs. Airbag. I never expect it. <laughs> All right, so we got two options here. I'm gonna go left. Nailers it says Nails. Here's one. Oh, oh, this is good. You're gonna like it. <clears throat> what do you get when you cross a porcupine with a balloon? Um, uh, what? What? Pop. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. I get it. <laughs> right, I get it. I get it. Yeah, all right. Do you guys got more? Why do seagulls fly over the ocean? Uh, gee, I'm stumped, Flapsy. Because if they flew over a bay, they would be called bagels. <laughs> You can tell he's enjoying it. Well, what do you get when you cross a cow and a pogo stick? Um, got, uh, I don't know, Slapsy. A milkshake! I knew that! I knew that! Oh, man. Okay, now where do toads put their feet when they need a rest? Oh, uh, toads! Hey, hey you're yeah, good, yeah, Maxie. You're really one. good. I, I didn't one. think I'd get yeah, too past nah, you there. That's alright, I got that one. Yeah. So, brother, my boy, where does a bird go when it loses its tail? Yeah, yeah, beats me. The retail store. <laughs> How many more do you all think they've got? Knock, knock. Who's there? Banana. Hey, banana who? Knock, knock. Well, who's there? Banana. Banana who? Knock, knock. Who's there? Banana. Banana who? Knock, knock. Who's there? Orange. Orange who? Aren't you glad I didn't say banana? <laughs> uh, that ain't Aren't you fair. glad you I doing? did not that say banana? What do you mean? I've that heard that one before. I hate it. What happened to the frog that broke down? Uh, I don't know. It got towed away. <laughs> I throw it away. I got throw it away. Okay. It's <laughs> not that. that pull away. It got one more? Away. We, do, we gotta do one more? I think we're gonna do one more. Yeah. A, what do you call a cat that walks across the sand? I don't know. What do I know about cats? Nothing. So I will tell you the answer if you listen. Please. You call a cat <laughs> Sandy Claus. <laughs> Hi, Putt Putt. Yeah, we're done Where with are you that. going? I was hoping to head over the hill, Pete, but it looks like the road's blocked. It sure is. I lost my hook somewhere this morning. I heard it drop off with a clank, but I don't remember where. Without my hook, I can't move even one of these pipes. I don't know what to do. Maybe I can find your hook for you. Oh, Putt-Putt, that would be so great. I could get this job done and be done in time to go see the Cartown 500. Okay, Pete. I'll keep my eyes open. So Pete's plan in its entirety was sit there 
And look at the squirrels make jokes. Free! The sign says free bricks. Those must be the bricks from the old building that used to be here. I think I'll take one. Simpler time. Hi, Betsy Bulldozer. Hey there, but, but what's up? Nothing much, Betsy. Just getting ready for the car down 500. Ooh, get my engines revving just thinking about it. All it's right, keep awesome it keep it to ride. yourself. It sure is. All right. Excuse me, Betsy. Do you mind if I pound in some of those nails back there? Not at all, Putt Putt. In fact, I could use some help. Got a load of these cheap nails. They keep popping out left and right all over the place. If you could smack them back in for me, you'd be doing me a huge favor. Okay, Betsy, I'll give it a try. Am I not getting paid for this? Is this a game? Wow, look at all the nails. I'd better get to work. Here I go. Oh. Boys, I've made a huge error. Oh, yep, there it is. All right, just like real life. I do I've not. I've got to pound all these nails in. Here oh. I go. Oh, right, well, yeah, here I go. Should we stop playing? Now? Oh, so it is a game that we're playing. Guess what, Betsy Bulldozer? I nailed in every last one of them. Now, why am I not surprised? Good work, Putt Putt. Say, I don't have much to give you, but I'd like to give you a kind of thank you gift. How about this genuine Junior Car Town Construction Crew safety helmet? Don't think it'll fit you, but it'll look great on your dog. Thanks a lot. Pep needs one of those for the big race. Oh, did we just get something on the checklist? It's the racing form I got from Redline Rick. Yep. I still need to please, find please, I don't some need extra high-powered, high-octane gasoline, I know where it some is. super speedy radial racing tires, yeah, okay. and a triangular flag with the number four on it, and then I'll be ready to enter the race. Yeah, the triangular flag will add 10 horsepower. All right, all right. Got to look for a hook. We're going to go north. Oh, it's the payphone. Okay. That's a sheep. Oh, I saw it. I saw it. And I saw that one. What sort of maniacs live in littering. this town? I think I'll pick up this empty bottle and recycle it. No one likes a dirty, rotten litterer, that's for sure. Hot ziggity, a bottle. They were a lot happier about this one than you were the other one. What was that about? Oh, I thought I was going down that path. I'm sorry. I'm going to try it again, just warning you. Is this a path? Oh, it's just got tires on it. Okay. Uh-oh. I say, I sounded my horn. I say. Not again. Didn't you hear my horn? Ah, yeah. What was that I ran over? Well, That's... who knows, because I can't see a thing. It's the hook! I wonder what that... Alright. Oh, there's the flashlight, so that solves that problem. Please be Swedish. Hi, Torval Tractor. Oh, hey there, Pot, but what brings you out this way? Mr. Baldini wanted me to pick up some things at your farm. Oh, yeah, he told me all about that. I knew he you would You go be. right ahead. Thanks. Wow, it's a flashlight. Hey, Pot, but you want that old thing? It's not really working. Do you know what's wrong with it, Torval? Oh, does it need batteries? Oh, yeah. No batteries. I have batteries. I it. have batteries. Jeez, thanks. Oh, don't you go mentioning it now. Oh, I'm telling everybody. I'm gonna put the batteries in. I don't think I can use that, bitch. A salad is a treat. 
any time at all. Just get ahead of lettuce all round and in a ball. Break apart the leaves so fresh and good for you. The lettuce that they grow is the best, I think it's true. I mean, that was just beautiful. All right, we're off to the farm. I wonder where I can find the fruits and vegetables Mr. Baldini asked for. There isn't anything I can pick there. I don't see anything I can pick right there. Oh, there needs to be something on it. Okay. A head of lettuce. I need some of those for Mr. Baldini. I better yeah. pick some. All right, all right. And then I think we go off screen. I like this view of Putt Putt. That's broccoli. I wonder if I can get close enough to reach that. So I gotta like manually click. All right, all right. All right we're getting a little tedious here. A little tedious. Hey, it's a zucchini. It That's is. what Mr. Baldini asked for. It I better pick one. Yep, it's correct. I'm not sure how to get there from here. All right, I get it. I have the bird's eye view. You don't. Viewers, I don't remember what the last thing was. I'm going to admit that to you right now. I have to get closer if I want to pick that. I don't think I can pick anything there. I can't. I can't pick. It. I'm not sure how to get there from here. Okay, you're the worst. I think I'm going to keep going. Until I can. Oh no. Oh no, it has begun. I'm not. How do I get there? You were already there, Putt Putt. It won't let me go up though. This is certainly interesting. Cabbage! Mr. Baldini didn't need any of those. Oh, he'll tell me. wonder which way I should go to get there. I can't reach that from here. Oh my gosh. Was this something Beep. we needed? I don't think Mr. Baldini wanted any of that. I'm so sorry, viewers. I'm gonna leave and consult the map. Is the map of no, the basket? How do I? I how do I? I wonder you which way I should go to, to work get with there. Putt -putt. You are very difficult. Let's, uh, let's have a little conversation with this crate. I don't think I can use that there. Oh no. They won't I let wonder me where I can find the vegetables Mr. Baldini asked for. Well, something tells me I gotta go north, so let's do that. Oh, viewers, what was it? Some of you are gonna use the power of YouTube time travel to look back, and then you're gonna comment, what a dumb cool. dummy dumb. Oh, a pumpkin! Mr. Baldini didn't need any of that. Well, I, it's still a pumpkin. There isn't anything I can pick there. I'll have to get closer if I want to pick that. I want. I can't. I can't reach that from here. It is a I'll labyrinth. I'll have to get closer if I want to pick that. This is where it's all gonna fall apart. I can't remember where the last thing was. I wonder. I can't reach that. Hmm. I can't drive straight there. Apples! I don't think Mr. Baldini wanted any of those. I can't pick that from here. Oh, I can go up now. Oranges. Mr. Baldini wanted one of those. Oh, I, I knew. Pick one. I knew that. I found everything for Mr. Baldini. He'll be so excited. Your need to say Mr. Baldini over and over again. Did he hurt you? All right, going on over here. Sure how oh to my get gosh, there from here. we've been here before, Pot Pot. Alright, there you go. 
Well, let's go back to the tunnel, do some tunnel stuff. Put the batteries hey, in there. I bet the batteries I got at the toy store will fit in this. Perfect. I don't think I can use that there. It's a hook. It's a I hook. I bet it's the one that Pete Crane lost. I bet it is. The music's getting pretty cool. We gotta have a little chat with Mr. Pete Crane. How you doing, boyo? Here's the hook, Pete. Is it yours? Is it ever? But, but, you are a great pal. Why don't you hook it back on me and I'll get these pipes moved. Thanks, but but Okay, stand back. I've got work to do. <gasps> nice. All clear. Thanks again, putt putt. It sure feels great to be able to work again. You're oh, welcome, man, Pete. That's great. Oh, we unlocked a pretty big section. Up. Oh. Hi, Rover. Hey, Putt Putt. Do you mind if I take this bottle for recycling? Of course not. It's all yours. Thanks. I'm loving this, like, 50s diner future vibe. What have you got to drink these days, Rover? Only the best, Putt Putt. We've got giant jumbo milkshakes and delicious icy cold milk. I'll have a giant jumbo milkshake, please, Rover. Best and biggest in car town, Putt Putt. Coming right up. Why don't Here I need to pay? Thanks. What do I owe you? Are you kidding? I owe you. I mean, you're the guy who brought me back from the moon. It's free to you, Putt Putt. What? Always. Gee, what? Rover, what? That's I didn't really play nice. that one. I didn't play that game. I don't know about the moon. Ah, uh, these things are good. Ah. Uh. Now I gotta play Pop Out Goes to the Moon. Alright, get, getting out of here. Let's go over here. Oh, is this is the tire shop. Well, there's, wow, there's a, a serious bottle. recycling I issue here. Alright, so the store's closed because the guy who runs it's broken down, but I gotta Great. grab it's one a of tire these. Patch kit. Chuck said I could take one so I can help him patch his tire. And I need to cut out a square, which I could do with the library. Oh, it's all coming together now. Now, all I have to do is go find some scissors so I can cut it out. Yeah, cut it out. It's over here while we're here. Hey, how are you? Here's some bottles, Mr. Crankcase. You've got to put them in the machine, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what you got to do, yeah. Okay, I'm getting a weird vibe. I'll need to put in two more bottles before I can recycle them. This the I'll only... need to put in one more bottle before I can recycle them. This is straight up the biggest problem with Pot Pot Games and Freddy Fish. All right. Weird. This is fun. This recycling machine sure is neat. It's also super not fast. I'll need to put in two more bottles. Oh my gosh! I, I know. I'll need to put in one more bottle before I can recycle them. I do apologize, viewers. I uh, didn't realize this would happen. Oh, it actually went down, so now I only have two. Alright, I gotta find one Hot more bottle. Ziggity. This recycling machine sure is neat! Alright, let's talk to this guy. Hi, Mr. Crankcase. Well, bust my bumper if it isn't putt putt. Hey, look at all the junk, eh? Mm-hmm. I guess so. There sure is a lot of it. Yeah? Isn't it great? Excuse me, Mr. Crankcase. This sure is an awfully big mess. Whew. You're telling me. Accidentally bumped into those shelves this morning and nearly twisted my lug nuts. I can hardly bend over to put all that stuff back on the shelf. Oh, don't worry. I can put it back for you. You do that and I'd be more tickled than a newly tuned turbo engine. Stop talking. After warning you, though, 
There's only one way everything fits. Stuff was packed in there pretty darn tight. Okay, Mr. Crankcase, I'll remember that. Oh, I hate it. Um, is, this is a, this is a puzzle. This is puzzle. My uh, immense focus is uh, due to the uh, intensity of this. Uh... Oh yeah, there it is. I mean, boys, this is hard. This isn't easy. Don't let anyone tell you that uh, doing YouTube and playing these game tutorials is easy. Also, who built this shelf? Shame on them. Yeah. Why does it sound like a weapon? Well, it's all done. Except I can't find a place to put this old gas can. But I need Ooh. the gas can! Pop my tires. Where did that old thing come from? As far as I'm concerned, you can keep it, but, but if you can use it, that is. I sure can! Now I can save some high-powered, high-octane gasoline for the race! Thanks a lot! No, thank you. You're the one who needs to be thanked. You're very welcome, Mr. Crankcase. I was glad to be able to help you. All right, there it is. That's uh, an unexpected surprise, but a welcome. <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, we gotta go library, which I'm pretty sure I just ignored. Hey, remember when I uh, teased you last time? Doing it again. All right, let's go to the library and cut out a square. I actually think we're almost there. Ooh, that rhymed. On I accident. don't think I can use that. Thing. I clicked. The I same need to button. cut this tire patch kit for Chuck. Now, which shape did Chuck need his tire patch kit cut into? Mm, that's not right. I think I cut that wrong. I'm not quite done with this, so I think I'll try again later. All right, so um, that's really where the voice acting definitely felt different Chuck as Putt-Putt. Chuck needs his tire patch cut into the right shape. Then he can use it to fix his flat tire. All right, let's do this. Very nice. And we'll go up here. Then over here. Then down here. Mm, that's not right. I think I cut that wrong. That's not the right shape. I need a new sheet. That's a triangle. I think I'll start over with a new sheet. That's a square. Yes, it is. How particular is this going to be? Because cutting out shapes was not my forte back in the day. Great! I oh. cut a square! Now I can help Chuck fix his flat tire. Let's go fix that flat tire. Hey, how are ya? Knox is flack here. Here you go, Chuck. Here's your tire patch kit cut into a square. Why, Putt-Putt, are you ever something? Why don't you slap that thing on me so I can be on my way? Okay, here goes. Good as new. Thanks to you. Well, I better get rolling. Drop by the tire center anytime, Putt Putt. I'd be more than happy to give you a deal on a new set of tires. Wow, I could use a set of super speedy radial racing tires for the big race. Well then, come on down, little buddy. I'll make you a deal of a lifetime. See ya. Do I need to use coins? 
Alright, we gotta go back to the grocery store to uh, turn in the food, which I just now realized I think was a town back, not a town forward. So let's go over here. Hey, how are ya? Here you go, Mr. Baldini! What was that? Thank you, Putt Putt. And just like I promised, here's a two of coins. Thanks. I think the, uh, the tires might cost something. That's why we have all these coins. You're a welcome. And if you want to fill up another produce box, you just let me know. Okay, so that's a game we can just keep playing, presumably. Okay. Let's go to gas. Oh, yeah, I like that. Extra high-powered, high-octane gasoline. Fill her up. There you go. Great. I've got enough for the race. How do you know how much you need for the race? All right. And then we are going here. Oh, yeah. Getting it done. We gotta go to the tire store. There he is, popping out of the side. Hey, it's a bottle! Do you mind if I recycle this, Chuck? Of course not, little buddy. Take it. It's yours. Thanks. Alright, let's check. Hello, Chuck. Hey, Putt Putt. I'm here to help if you need me. Thanks. Chuck, I was wondering if I could buy a set of those super speedy radial racing tires. Redline Rick says these are the kind I need to enter the Car Town 500. Best tire on the market. And am I ever going to make you a deal since you helped me out today? Free. Gee, thanks, Chuck. How Free. much are they? Normally, they're two coins a piece. But for you... I'll give you all four tires for only four coins. That's a savings of four whole coins. I've got four coins. Well, how about that? Hand them over, little buddy, and you got yourself a brand new set of tires. Am I going to have to do it one at a time? There you go, Chuck. Four oh, coins. Game Thank you kindly, Putt-Putt. Now I'm going to have to measure you with these calipers to make sure those tires will fit you. <laughs> Don't worry, it ain't going to hurt. Too much. Well, well, a perfect fit. Putt putt, you just bought yourself some primo top of the line super speedy radial racing tires. Would you like me to put them on you now, or would you like to wait until race time? I don't want to race around Car Town too fast, so I'll just put them on at the track. <laughs> oh, yep, that is, yep. In other news, let's go to the track. I think I have everything. Why do I? Why isn't it like speed running me to the track? I got the helmet. I got the tires. Oh, I need a flag. No. I need a red flag with the number four on it. Let's do uh, three more bottles while we're here. Where do I get a red flag with a number four? That could be a toy store situation. I'll need to put in two more bottles before I can recycle them. Yeah, 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 I get it. I'll need to put in one more bottle before I can recycle them. Also, I didn't use the brick for anything. What's the brick all about? <laughs> Great! I got a coin! This recycling machine sure is neat! Maybe if I look around, I can find some more bottles to recycle. Okay, alright, let's get out of here. That was terrifying. Yep, so we're looking for a red flag. You know, things you don't want to see on a date. I've not seen any there. She's got concern in her eyes. Woo. Uh, 
Oh yeah. We gotta save that cat. What happens if I do that's this? That's the coin I earned. That's that's just that's just there. There's another bottle on the ground. Looks like I can keep picking up bottles endlessly. Hello, Torval. Hey there again, Putt Putt. <laughs> oh, it is growing. So there's a chance that it's in there. I don't want it to be in there. I'm gonna try not to go through that, although... Oh no, it probably is in there. You got a flag? So, Putt Putt, how do you like my newest addition for the zoo? It's a baby bush baby. Oh, it's so cute. Uh, I don't know how a brick would help the cat. I don't think I can use that there. It's a flashlight. That's the coin I earned. This game is for children, and here I am, lost and confused. Let's try uh, the toy store, see if the flag's there. Ooh, you know what would be in a toy store? Something that would distract a cat, maybe. Yep, yeah, there it is. Oh, look, Putt Putt, Peter and the Wolf, a pop-up book. I like those. That's, that was it? That's all you had for me? I'm not playing Pachinko again, so we're out of here. Um... Oh, you know what? Firefighters save cats. So, Putt Putt, are you going to race in the Car Town 500? I sure hope so, Smokey. There's just one more thing I have to get first. Well then, I'm sure you'll have no trouble. The Car Town 500 is quite a race. Almost the whole town will show up to watch it. Are you coming, Smokey? No, not me. I'll be right here at the fire station, on call. Throw a it's brick out. All right. So that's a no-go. Man, I feel like I'm missing something. So now back at the start. Be funny if I just had a red flag. Ah. The outlook. Oh, I can't listen to the radio while driving, huh? This is the least free situation I've ever seen. Hey, I'm looking for a flag. Hey there, hi there. Any luck fetching your gear for the big race? Yep. Now all I need to do is to get a flag. Then I'll be all ready for the race. Keep it up, buddy. Rock and roll. I know there's someone in the comments already. You don't know where the flag is? Are you a dumb? And well, I'm playing it for the first time. We're just doing the backtrack strategy. Let's see what's going on here. An empty bottle? This doesn't belong here. I should nope. recycle it. Yep. So there's a chance that it's like in the car wash or in the color change place, which will require me to spend coins. Oh, it's another empty bottle. I think I'll recycle it. It's a, it's a weird place to put it. There's no, like, logic to that, but, like... Okay, that's pretty funny, actually. I saw that, and I'm going back for it. Just in case... This no. bottle doesn't belong on the ground. It should be recycled. Yep. 
Uh, also, uh, there's the other possibility of it's in the farm, like deep in it. So let's get another order here. Hello. Want to go back to the farm and pick us some more produce? Sure, I can do that. What do you need this time? Well, uh, let me see. I need a two of fruits and a one of vegetable that look like this. Okay, Mr. Baldini. You are great to help, Putt Putt. So it's a turnip, apple, pear. Pretty thoroughly checked that. Feel good about that. All right. Yeah, something that could get a cat. Oh, that Ralphie. Did you know that last year he buried Mr. Airbag's new headlight? Poor Mr. Airbag couldn't drive at night until we found them. Oh, my goodness. Once I raced in the big race, did you know that? No. How did you do? I came in second, right behind Tammy Torpedo. That's great. Tammy Torpedo. Something in the library to lure the cat. Hey, numbers! Red Line Rick said I need my official number on my racing flag. Looks like I need to find a flag first, though. Alright, thank you for that. I'm still looking for the flag. So, this phone booth is just menacing, right? I don't think it's over here, but we're gonna backtrack everything. It would be weird for them to put it uh, right by the hook. All right, here I we need go. To be on the lookout for the fruits and vegetables for Mr. Baldini. Yep. All right, so kind of hoping for a red flag situation. Not normally looking for red flag situations. Let's see what we got here. Grapes. No. There isn't flags. anything I can pick there. This, uh, is very I'm not much sure how to. Ooh, grapes. This is very reminiscent of being in the Safari Zone in the original Pokemon. <laughs> Not sure what section this is. Hoping the next section is the right one. Gosh, I, only, I just need to find Surf. I'm not. How do I get there? Really, I needed to do that for you. Look, a pear. I need to pick something in that shape for Mr. Baldini. Proud of you. Go back. We need to go back. I can't read. I wonder if I can get close. Apple! That's the shape of the fruit I need to get from Mr. Baldini. Oh, yeah. Go over there. Who was in charge of the music of this section? Because you did an amazing job. Oh, let's try going left here. How do I get there? Oh my gosh, I need to. So I don't know what's up with the little log thing. I actually think something's up with the log, right? Alright, let's go here. That's cabbage. No, that isn't the shape of the vegetable I need to get for Mr. Baldini. Yep, take your time explaining that, yeah. How do I get there? I'm not sure how to get there from here. I'll have to get closer if I... I don't see anything I can pick right there. I don't think... I can't... Pick. I'll have to get closer if I want to pick that. 
Lisa. Check it out, cauliflower. I don't think that matches the shape Mr. Baldini gave me. Viewers, I don't like cauliflower. I'm not a particularly picky eater. I just don't like it. I'm not sure how to get there from here. I feel a pretty uh, strong suspicion that I am wasting my time. The flag is not here, but is for some reason in the car wash or car color changing facilities. I w hmm. I can't drive straight there. Beat. That matches the shape Mr. Baldini gave me. Yeah. Great! I found everything for Mr. Baldini. Yeah, He'll you be did. So excited. So proud of you. All right. I'm gonna say with confidence, the flag's not there. Hello. Do you have a flag? No. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know um, how to move that cat. Here you go, Mr. Baldini. Thank you, Putt Putt. And just like I promised, here's a two of coins. Thanks. All right, let's go to the three coin place. You're a welcome. And if you want to fill up another produce box, you just let me know. I think that was this one. I think the car wash is two, cartoon color is three. That's one of three. Now just two more and you're through the door. That's two, buckaroo, thank you kindly. That's two, buckaroo, thank you kindly. Yeehaw, that's all free. Get ready to drive on through. Oh boy! Nice harmonica. Pick I see, your color, cowboy. I see no flag. What are we thinking? I'm thinking cool, blue. blue. Oh boy! Now close your eyes real tight, partner. I hate that. Don't make that. Do I get to keep these? Hey, partner. Have a peek. Looking good. That was a blast. Alright, uh, it was not in there. I think, I wonder if I can talk to Mr. Was he Fender Bender with the, with the lost cat? I wonder if he gives me some hints. What's up, buddy? Hi, Mr. Fender Bender. Hey, you're back. I wish my cat was. We'll get him out soon. I just have to find the right thing to do it. I'm not sure that will work. It's a flashlight. I'm not sure that will work. No one expected that. Well, if I was smaller, I'd just reach right in there and grab that giddy. I mean, grab that kitty. Well, don't you worry for a minute, Mr. Fender Bender. I'll get him to come out of there for you. I promise. Well, that would be Jim Dandy. Gosh, I don't think I can reach in there. But maybe I can find something that will make him want to come out, Mr. Fender Bender. Well, if you did, that would be the cat's bow wow. I mean, the cat's meow. I'm not sure that will. Those are the super spats. My it's a those are the bottles. I don't think I can use. I don't think. Why I can is it letting me move this around? I'm not here. sure that will work. Wow! What does the cat want? Because like the brick would just fit there. 
Bonzo is one cutsy gnat. I mean, nutsy cat. I can't wait until you find something to make him come out from under there. I'll find something that will work, Mr. Fenderbender. I just have to figure out what it is. All right, viewers. The best idea I've got is maybe I get groceries again and I leave the groceries out? Is that right? Want to go back to the farm and pick us some more produce? Sure, I can do that. What do you need this time? Well, uh, let me see. I need uh, three vegetables that look like this. Okay, Mr. Baldini. You are a great helper, Putt Putt. breakdown okay at the Car Town 500 race, Putt-Putt. I know you'll do great. Thanks, Pete. It's going to be fun. Is there something here? Hey again, Putt-Putt. Hey again to you too, Betsy Bulldozer. took one. I don't want to be greedy. I'm thinking, okay. <laughs> bottle for recycling? Of course not. It's all yours. Thanks. <laughs> I have a carton of milk. Please. Milk! Over. Freshest you'll find anywhere, Putt Putt. Coming right up. Don't make me drink it now. Cats like milk. Here you go. Okay, mm, that's it. cold milk. Maybe I'll save it for a little while. This better be it. I don't think I can use that there. I have some milk, yes. Mr. Fender Bender. Maybe that would do the trick. By all means. I mean, by all means. Give it a try. Here, kitty. Here, Bonzo. Come and get it. My pings and pistons, you did it. Oh. Now I'd better be on the safe side and cover oh up that gosh. hole so he doesn't go bolting down there again. A... Wow, a racing flag. Yep, genuine certified. Real good at hugging poles, too. I mean, plugging holes. Gee, I sure could use a racing flag. Happy to give it to you, Pit Pit. If you find me something else pit, to plug pit. up the hole. You know what, Mr. Fender Bender? I think I might have something that will work. Peachy, son, let's have a look. It's this brick. I have something to plug up that hole, Mr. Fender Bender. 
It's a brick! Couldn't be poor Murphy. I mean, more perfect, son. Slide her on in there. Uh, perfect fit! And you go ahead and keep that flag. I certainly have no need for it anymore. Wow, thanks, Mr. Fender Bender. Now I just have to put my official racing number on it. Yep, let's go to the library. Like all cool racers do before a race. See, Look at all three. the numbers! Oh, okay. Redline Look. Rick told me I need oh, to have my, my official number on my There's racing flag. Let's them. see. I think he said I need a four. That but one's I four. Be the Mach That's the five. number I... Hey, this is great! I did everything I needed to do to enter the Car Town 500. Hot ziggity! I'm ready to race! Hi, Redline Rick. I got all the things I need for the race. That's great, Putt-Putt. Just in time. You go on over to the garage then and boys get you all fixed up real race car like. I'll meet you out on the racetrack. You're as ready to race as something that's really ready to race. I Thank sure you. am. Well then, go ahead on up to the starting line. We're just about to start. Contestants, start your engines. On your mark, get set, go! Am I ready? Oh, I'm racing. Oh my gosh, this is an actual race. How do I boost? There's a... Uh... Oh, we're all, uh, we're all crashing. We're all crashing and stuff. Oh. I am in third place. Oh, I'm in second place. Best race car driver. But he has racing stripes. And there's a duck! Oh my gosh. You thought Mario Kart was the world's most accurate racing simulator? I have found a new one. Let's cut the corner, you know, kiss the apex. Oh, we're getting past. Oh yeah. Oh, those are some hard turns we're taking here, boys. Oh no, putt putt! Putt putt! Oh, we're lapping people? Oh no, he's in first. We're cutting it. We're cutting it. Oh, he spun out. Yeah, uh, the flag has changed. We're on four out of five. Oh man, Putt Putt's in first. We got the power of friendship and kindness on our team. Oh, we're on the final lap and I'm hitting the ducks. You know. Race ducks. Taking these corners hard. As hard as I can. And with that, first place with Putt Putt. Ziggity, I did it! How about that? First place! You were cruising! Good job out there, Putt Putt! Thanks, Redline Rick! So how about it? You wanna race again? Nah, dog. Too much of a good thing's not good for I you. think I've raced enough for today. Well then, let's go to the winner's circle! Ladies and gentlemen! 
gentlemen, I present to you the champagne and most fastest racer in the car down 500, Putt Putt. Way to go, buddy. Wow, thanks a lot. I'd like to thank everyone in Cartown for helping me get all the things I needed. And Mr. Crankcase, if you ever need help cleaning up again, just let me know. I'll see you all next time. And don't forget, it's not if you win or lose, it's how you race around the track. Ask any racer, any real racer. <laughs> Whether you win by an inch or a mile. I mean, it's not important if you win or lose. <laughs> but there you have it. That was Putt Putt Joins the Race. I was excited for this one. I thought it was about time that the car, the game all about a car, uh, actually had a race. I don't ever want to see that photo again. Can that change? Thank you. But let me know what you thought in the comments below. Where is this one? in your list of favorite putt-putt games and don't forget to like the video and subscribe to see more putt-putt and humongous games i've been playing freddy fish already you know i've been playing putt-putt and we also have been doing some pajama sam games don't forget to leave a comment below on your favorite and least favorite part i already know your least favorite part was me not being able to save that cat for so long <laughs> this has been Nox is flack, and I will see you in the next one.